Music was always really, really important for me. That was my world. Imagining textures and different kind of surfaces and some kind of degrees of light. It's not something that I try to do. It's there when I close my eyes. I loved that space when I was a child, and it was so strong that often I think I prefer to stay there rather than reach to other people. You go down, yeah, and that makes a low, low noise. Composing is a really, really solitary occupation, and personally I struggle very much with that. It's usually not sounds that I hear, it's a musical idea, it's sort of an abstract idea of movement or direction or character. And only in, in the later stage the, the, the actual pitch comes. I mostly struggle with the formal aspect and how to create, let's say, a coherent narrative. In any case, it's a very, very painful process. It's never easy. But we should still always hear the, the, the air coming in. So, already, don't... I felt don't that down. we don't have so much in common. Maybe I would enrich him and he would enrich me too, because it needs to be mutual relation. It's true that it's very good for your work that you are able to discuss it with someone else, to get out of your cocoon and to have someone else's eyes, especially if they're someone who's talented as experienced as Kaya. The idea is that it really helps you to refine your expression. I think the G flute is maybe better. Nobody should be too busy to give time to other people. I hope I can become for him a trusted friend. Vasco's situation is still that he's a racing star. I have no doubt that he has a very splendid career in front of him. I sort of felt that I had a point where I had to think a little bit about where to go from there. This mentorship was a big step in my career. I'm not sure if at the end of the year my style will be different or if it will ever be different, but I certainly will incorporate this experience in my growth as a composer.